Hello everybody, and welcome to the episode of How to Play. This time, it's Darkness 2. And I pretty much like this game, mainly because it's kind of stupid. Alright, so first let's just go with the options. Okay, so audio. Yeah. I don't like the fact that it's, uh... Like, the good thing is it tells you what the device you're using right now is. But I don't like the fact that it's just sliders and doesn't indicate what the volume level is for any of this. That's that's bad. Game options, pretty useful. Display. There's actually there should be a larger list, but there isn't. But for me personally, this is actually enough. Vertical sync off as always. Controls. All right. Yeah, that's kind of. It doesn't even. I don't think it allows you to even remap anything. Anyway, we are right where I'm fighting a boss. So probably the worst place for me to start this video, but meh. And I'm gonna basically show you how to do quad wielding and stuff. Alright, so I have a gun. I, I grab those by either pressing E or Q. Q allows me to use this guy. Middle mouse button allows me to use the other guy. And that was very rude of him. Oh, Alright, so we're gonna up the call got other guns. And then we can do ex execute if like you see their heart uh, pounding. You can do execute. Now this is actually new game plus. This is, I'm actually having trouble with just talking because I'm just trying to keep myself alive. Alright, now if I press 1, I get more health by just doing ACQ, which is basically like how you can regain more health but also you can eat the hearts of people you just recently healed through the shotgun love these things yes just give me yes. See, if i press e when i'm near a dead body like that i can just oh i'm gonna impale a guy I hope that you can actually see this because it's actually quite dark yeah Love that. I never propane tank for you. Prison for you. Ow, you fucking douchebag. For some reason, a gun. Actually, it does affect it, but not enough. Oh god, light. Yeah, light is bad for Jackie. Because the power he's using is the darkness, and it would prefer to stay out of light. Otherwise, I can't use it. Ah, oh, I didn't mean to throw him. Oh god. Uh. Wait, I can also use this as a shield. Oh my god, if I throw this, it's... I hate this guy. I absolutely hate this guy. Jesus Christ! Okay, now we now we got dual pistols. Now, rather than being able to aim like by pressing the right mouse button, I can only uh, right mouse button does the 
left and left does right. Which is sounds really stupid. This game does a really bad job of actually indicating where the hell he is. Yeah, it's... But it's still pretty fun seeing as how you can use the darkness. I might actually be able to kill this guy. By just... By just shooting at him. Yay! I did it the wrong way, but who cares? He's getting away, monkey. Yeah, I don't care. I'm not gonna end the video here because that was very bad commentating from me. Ooh. Oh yeah, I forgot I could do this. For anyone who doesn't actually know the uh, story of the darkness, I'll just recap. It's basically, you're a mobster and, well not just any mobster, you're a head of a mob and... Uh, basically, you have a power called the darkness, which is just these tentacle things. And you can control them. Oh god. Anyway, this is... Can I skip this? No, I can't. Anyway, but I pretty much just showed you the gameplay. It's actually very simple. It's just standard gun mechanics. The only thing that is added to it is just what took you so long? Is just um the quad wielding, which is for the darkness. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time.